All right, I'm gonna show you how to cut an avocado. So what you're gonna do is take the avocado and insert your knife, just get a sharp knife, until you hit the pit. You can't go any farther than that. And then you just kinda leave your knife still and move the avocado around in a circle. Watch your fingers. And then once you get all the way back around, you'll have cut through the whole avocado and you can peel it apart. It should peel apart evenly. There you go, you have two halves. And then you take your first half and be careful not to cut, obviously, through the skin. It's pretty thick, but it's, like I said, it's like butter, so it, it goes smoothly right through the edge. And you just cut lengthwise three or four times. And you can keep it like this, but we want to do cubes. So then I'm going to turn the avocado and make it like a grid and cut horizontally. And then once you've done that, you take a spoon. You take a spoon and just scoop out. You get right along the edge in between the avocado and the skin and scoop it out so you get nice cubes. And I'll put them in this bowl here. Nice cubes. Um, some people say, they just take it and they squeeze it like this and they come straight out. And they do, but I'm trying to keep the cubes pretty here because they're going to go on top of a salad. Um, and then for the other half, put this aside, your seed is in there. So all you have to do, you have your avocado on the ground, watch your fingers and just whack the seed. And then take it and spin it and out it comes. Voila. And then you can just set, you have to get the seed off. Sometimes it's kind of hard. Sometimes, there it goes, it went away. You kind of have to whack it on the side of something to get it off. But you do the same thing with this half, cut it lengthwise, and then the opposite way. And you scoop it out. And if you're doing this for guacamole or Anything, or if you're gonna eat it later, you can squeeze some lime juice on it to keep it from turning brown. Or a lot of times you can just put some saran wrap over it and just keep the air from getting to it and it'll keep it from getting brown. And also, a trick I learned about guacamole. If you want your guacamole not to turn brown, of course lemon juice works, but you leave that seed in there, in, it kind of gives it a little flare, but you leave it in there if you're, if you're having a party or something and it will not turn brown. Um, so that's another little trick. And um, so that's how you cut an avocado.